This is actually my rice cooker, if you guys are standing there. to cook right so I have many and I mean many let me show you guys so I don't lie like knives every single type of knife I have a lot and have a lot of scissors but I have a specific one that I really like like really really like and I know I used to use this so it shouldn't be here but I, I only like like these type of knives I don't like the, the little type of knife or the skinny type I hate that this is an English cucumber I love English cucumber I don't know maybe this is better lighting I'm just trying to find the better lighting so you guys can see oh my god it looks horrible there maybe So I'm making, what are you making Flocka? Yes, I am making, cucumber and lemon with onion salad and some cilantro. Let me show you guys, I think you guys can see it. trying to break the cucumber wrap obviously it says don't wash but obviously we're gonna wash it because nobody wants dirty cucumbers the board that i'm using is marble how's everybody doing you guys are doing marvelous oh, that's my <sighs> excelente estoy haciendo una ensalada de you guys have to watch and then later i'll show you my feet okay I said it. I break it like this and then I break it in half. Listen, if there's chefs here, I'm not a chef, but I could definitely, I cut them very thin because if you put some lime on it, So good. Make sure you wash your vegetables because I don't want to get sick, okay? This is my number one favorite. Every time I cut cucumber, I want to eat it. Bye, you. You guys have been invested in these type of bowls. You guys don't know what you're missing. How's everybody doing? Everybody's waiting. Are you guys going for a Halloween party or something? 
I would like to go to a Halloween party, but I'll tell you the truth. Mm, I don't know. Not a Halloween type. I don't like holidays. Not an expert. I think I could cut pretty well. What is everybody doing right now? I'm just showing you my salad. If you guys stay to the end, I'll show you my feet. Sorry guys, I haven't posted last week. It's been a crazy, crazy week. Hey Fuzzy, look, that's for you. And I like the cucumbers because when you open these, they get like so damn soft. It's just, I hate them. Once you open them, they're suck and I'm not giving them to anyone. Okay, so I cut the cucumbers. I need to cut the cucumbers first and then I'm gonna chop the onions. Yeah, thin slices are the best because I think let me put you guys up here. It's better. Thin slices grab the juices better, I think, right? Or we all think, no? So it is what it is. What we're gonna do? Try to make it work. There. I actually have a tripod, but I don't wanna get. I cut it this thin. And my cucumber salad is so good. I put onions. Hi! No, guys. Now I'm going to cut the onions. And I'm going to... How do you say? I'm going to take the, the... The bitterness. So I put them in hot water. With salt. Yeah, I know. Impressive. And I will chop them finely. So are you guys going to any? Oh, gracias. Are you guys going to any Halloween parties? I know, so I'm like two. I actually, have I been? Yeah, I usually go as a vampire or a vampire because I like, I like to dress black. I think black is the best color ever. What do you guys think? Why black? Because black makes you look thin. Mm. It's not like I don't really like my weight. It doesn't matter. I'm the way I want to be, but I just like black. It makes you look thin and nice and sexy. So I probably wear like, if, if I was going, I would wear like black jeans, very skinny, high-waisted, bodysuit, Dark lipstick. You know, vampire. And obviously, the baby daddy will dress exactly the same too. So I slice them like this, and I thinly slice them. Like really, really finely. This is not the light, the, the night that I like, but we gotta work with what we got. The one that I like is inside the sink, but I have so much place that I just wash. I don't think I'm gonna find it. Thanks! I know I love black too. If you guys ever have the chance to see my closet, most of my colors are black. Black. <laughs> Thanks! <laughs> I would definitely so mind the tears is the onions I hate that oh god I hate it um yeah so my wardrobe is a lot of sweatpants now because it's winter but I have black shirts black tank top black bodysuit black jeans black jeans just 
For me, that's easy. And then shoes, I have a lot of shoes, a lot. If you guys want to my shoes, let me know. Send me an email, I'll, I'm sending my shoes. I'm gonna buy more, so I'm sending my old shoes. And these shoes are like 10, 11, 12 years old. So I'm gonna cut two onions. I'm crying. <gasps> Why? You know, I saw that somebody bought these glasses, but it's not that, people. It's the nose. The nose makes you cry, okay? Not the glasses, not the goggles. The goggles are gonna protect your eye, but you're still gonna get through your nose. Don't go there, Carlos. Don't go on my video. Go. Hi, everyone. Let me see. Nail color black. Hello, yes, nail color black. <laughs> you should chew gum. You want me to chew gum? I don't even have gum. Mm. Mm. So, it's going to be two. Two onions. I'm working on a big project, guys. Bear with me. I receive emails from uh, Steve from Panama. Um, I receive emails from the guys saying, um, "I was selling shoes and socks." I love onion. I hate the crying, but onion is so good. I'm gonna cry. I do this, right? But I don't really breathe, and it still goes in your nose. There's nothing you can do. Freaking onion is so much bitter. You see, I'm crying. But so good with the onions and the peppers i love it i always have like this thing that i cook like i'm gonna cut my finger but i think that's my adhd and my anxiety okay here with the onions i'm crying <laughs> i am actually cried <laughs> So I put my running hot water because I don't really have time to boil. And I put a lot of salt. Remember, the salt is going to take all that bitterness. And it's going to be so good. going to taste like a little bit of salt, a little bit of lime. I also put vinegar too. So, so I'm making rice and fried fish with cucumber salad oh my god so good oh i am crying so and then i put i put sesame oil some limes some vinegar and cilantro oh my god cilantro is like top notch okay mm, i'm ready to charge i know it's so good today it's too Fiona Junior's birthday. He wants to let you know he loves you and he expects you. It's not you. Do. Oh, happy birthday! Chavo Guerrera. Guerrero, right? Junior. Very nice. Thanks. Oh, I know I'm going to cry. So, I think this is a nice angle. So, it's going to be really hot. I hate this lighting. <sighs> okay. <laughs> Chavo Guerrero Jr. I got it. And then I'm going to put some salt. But the salt is pink salt. Because why not? Okay, it's Himalayan salt. 
Um, the rice that I use is jasmine rice because I cannot use any more than that rice. Like that's my, I'm like obsessed with that rice. And this is the salt that I use. I, I have a salt one like this. That is over there, so I'm using this one. Himalayan salt. I put a lot, so it could be nice and has flavor. Because right now you eat it, it's gonna be like bitter. And, ugh, nobody wants that. And I'm gonna put a splash of vinegar. It's gonna be so good. I promise. What am I worried? I'm wearing my champion. Mm. My championship. It sounds like it tastes really good. It really tastes good. Oh, where you're from? And Stephen Panama. Where are you from? So I put that there and you do it twice. You, 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 you know, strain the water and you redo it again. Why the hell is stuck? I hate when the freaking salt gets stuck in my hands. Oh, that's my pet peeve. I can't do it. But when I'm doing the thing, I usually do the other one, but this one, it was here. Oh, it stresses me out. Okay, so you put the salt. This is where I wish I had like a salt scooper. I think I'm gonna do that. Okay, I'm gonna put it on the side. So right here I have a fish, the all-purpose flour, my cucumber. Now I'm gonna cut my green peppers. I was born in New York. Nice! I'm from Michigan. Have you? Smitty, you're from Michigan? I would like to go to Michigan. Oh, nice. Do you still live here or you don't live here anymore? Does anyone know why the peppers get bad so quick? I just don't want it. I think it, right here is the climate. The climate it changes the whole entire, I don't know, the environment, or if it's cold, if it's hot, it's just, I can't. I love peppers. And these freaking peppers, when the climate changes from cold to hot quick, it starts getting bad. I hate it. So usually I blend my vegetables and I put, I make like a green vegetable sauce so I could put it in my food. And it works, but I forgot to do this one. And I'm, and Fuzzy is looking at me like, give me some, but I'm not giving you nothing, okay? Sir? You guys don't know Fuzzy is my dog, AKA my son. In my daughter's eyes, that's her son. And I'm the one who's here to talk. So how's everybody doing? What did you do on Saturday? I've been home, stressed, but I've been happy because I'm cooking, spending time with the kids. So. Nobody wants an ugly salad, okay? Everybody wants a nice, cute salad that looks good, that tastes good. So make your best so you could make it pretty. Because people, I, I get it. People eat with their eyes. Doesn't matter if the salad is amazing. It looks like crap. Somebody's going to eat that. So here, Fuzzy, I'll give you this one. Here. He loves green peppers. He loves green peppers. He's like a, a guinea pig. He will love, he will just, 
Oh, yes. This, I, I can't throw an egg, but that's, that's nice. I usually throw um, eggs and everything, so I need my protein because, you know, when you work out, you need the protein. But this is like an Asian salad. I put soy sauce. I put a little bit of sesame oil, sesame seeds, a little bit of... <laughs> a lot of people don't get it. People eat with their eyes, and it's it's just the way it is. So if it doesn't look pretty, they don't eat it. Even if it's amazingly, the taste is insane, incredible. Nope. People eat with their eyes. So if I make an ugly salad, it's not like I give a shit, but they can, they're not going to eat it. So I need them to eat it. Well, the baby daddy will eat it because he doesn't care how it looks. And if he doesn't, well, well... You have to eat it. Okay, Fuzzy, I think I'll give you these pieces. But if it looks ugly, if it looks pretty, everybody will eat it. So, the chances are if the salad looks good, they think it tastes good. But sometimes it really don't. I know. I know, Williams. It's so good, right? Here, Fuzz. Here you go. Oh. So I have jasmine rice. It's done. I can see it. My fish is marinating. I put, guys, I found like the best. And I mean the best. Here, Fuzzy. Seasoning. For everything. It has is the same season, but it tastes. Oh my god, I love Olive Garden. <laughs> I know, Steve. Um I love Olive Garden. I go to Olive Garden to have the Sopa Toscana. That is my favorite. So when you guys go, make sure you have it. And I always have the same food. I always have the seafood Alfredo. Oh my God, it's so freaking amazing. I love it. Okay, let me see if my phone, oh, my phone is charged. Let me move you guys. Yeah, so I love, love Olive Garden. And I mean, love, I'm obsessed with it. It's, it's that serious. No fuzzy. So I go to Olive Garden and I have the Sopa Toscana. Most of the time I go on Fridays because when I'm home, I say to my husband, I'm like, uh, can we go to Olive Garden? And he's going to be like, yes, we can go to Olive Garden. I know. A lot of people don't go to Olive Garden, seriously. A lot of people don't love it at all. And I'm like, what? People don't love Olive Garden? That's amazing. That nobody knows how good it is. So I love Olive Garden and I go eat the Sopa Toscana. That's where I go for. I don't go for the salad, but I do go for the, for the Sopa Toscana and the seafood Alfredo. And I could eat that and salad. And I usually have like three bowls of soup because usually we work out hard that day and then we go eat so it's really good are you guys cooking something oh i never had mozzarella steaks in olive garden i'm gonna try i'm really gonna try the mozzarella steaks in olive garden and really didn't have ever mozzarella steak in olive garden i had I usually have that and that's it. And I want to eat and eat and eat more of that, but I just don't. And I'm putting in my salad, I'm putting aguacate. Avocado. Oh my God, it is amazing.
I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Along with your very natural, beautiful face. It's been a long time. Guys, you guys are so funny. I'm eating nachos with mild salsa. I just love it. Oh, I love it. I just want to. Buddy! You can't have it. I, put, I poured some in here. And I put. Dump it in here. It's broken because my son fell on his ass on my nachos. So, you're here, fuzzy? Mmm. Mmm. See that? I'm going to have time to beat the finger hand in there. Mm-mm. Mmm. It's so good. It's really good. Wow. I didn't know there was filters in here. In Zoya. You guys know that? I need... I need a vacation. I need a tan. I'm so pale right now. I'm good lighting. Not helping me at all. Wait, guys, give me one second. I'm gonna bring my computer. I'm done. I just got to fry the fish. And that's it. That's all it is. I like always this background because this background is like white. I still look pale. It doesn't matter. But at least I could see you guys and I could answer your questions. Guys, I have a big surprise, a huge surprise. It's just so... There I am, no thanks. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna cover this right here, there you go. Mm. You can't have more. Okay, I have something to tell you guys. I have water. I'm very afraid of Halloween movies, but I watch Hocus Pocus too. That's not scary, but for me that was amazing. It was so good. Did you guys watch it? I'm gonna try the mozzarella sticks for sure. And I'm gonna try. Mm. Let me know any movie that you want me to watch I will try to watch it mm. I know every time there's a movie it's always better the first one than the second one But so 
found me a good Halloween movie so I could watch, and I'll let you guys know. So, tell me something you guys do that you know that you like. You don't know that you do it, but you still do it. Okay, I'll start. I do this, and I go like this. It's so weird. Okay, I'll watch it. I don't know why I do that. I always do that, and my sisters do it too. It's so weird. Harry Potter. And... Wednesday Adams. Hi. So, so, tell me something weird that you guys do. The people notice that you do it, but they don't say nothing. It's so weird. I, I didn't notice I did that until, like, they told me. But then, the, I don't know, my sister does it too. My older sister. It's like, I get the food and I put it, like I lick my finger like this. Like this, it's so crazy. Weird. But it's, it is. Crazy. So are you guys supposed to be working? Are you guys home? Yes. Before my life ends, I will show my feet. No, I don't like scary movies. I remember the movie, the first movie that I saw that it was really scary for me was Candyman. I couldn't handle it. Thank you too. So, I stopped watching. 1978. Wow, everything that has to be scary. Um, no. I saw Chucky number one and I was freaked out. Oh, yeah, you're back. I saw I saw Saw number one. But I could, I didn't see. I saw this. I couldn't. I'm sorry. I'm a chicken. I admit it. No. Tell me something that is not that scary that I, I think I could handle. No, Fuzzy. No more for you. The Halloween was trash? Oh. Ah! Hi, puppy. Hi, baby. Hi. Go this way. Go this way. Why? Because I'm in the camera. Why? Have a squilla. She's okay. Are you going tomorrow? I don't really feel good and my staff not going. You don't feel good? Yeah, my 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 staff not going tomorrow. You're going? My staff. So are you going? My staff not going tomorrow. Okay. So uh, what's on the table? Are you going? No. Okay, we'll talk later. Stop. And my staff not going tomorrow. <laughs> What are you 
own clothes. What's in the box? You won't like it. Oh, okay. You want some chips? No. Halloween ends the best one in my opinion. Okay, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try. I think maybe I take two shots or something. Has anyone tried mochi? Do my do your do you do your fingernails and tools for Halloween? Okay. Usually oh, I'm gonna make a video. I have done before, but in the winter you guys know that you're you're in on clothes shoes all the time, right? But I like to make my nails naked. So I take maybe a month off nail polish and you know I just take care of my toes because your winter you're like enclosure, you know? And in the summer it's you always it's only three months. So I try not to have a lot of nail polish because that's when the nail gets yellow and brittle and you don't want that. So that's when I'm home. I'm usually barefoot or in socks. I'm not in closed shoes because I'm always working so I have shoes and as soon as I get home I take them off. So I think that's a good thing. And your feet is dry. Oh, be quiet, buddy. Your feet will get dry if you don't take care of them. So I haven't done my toes. I actually, last time that I did my toes was at home because the lady was not there and I needed to do my toes. So, but I usually take a free time. And like, I think usually I take it like maybe on November or October. No, I think it's November. And then for December, maybe I do it again. And sometimes I took two months off and I just have them bare. I think that's the best thing for um, nail polish and for your nails. So if you guys are looking for a solution so your nails will be yellow, that's what it is. People tell me, they always send me emails and all this information like why your nails are so nice and clean because of that. Because most of the time I take a break. You guys know, right? From my experience, people don't actually do their toes. Thanks, Williams. I love you guys too. People that do their toes all the time, okay? You see, some people do, they file their nails and they do their toes. Some people change them every week. Some people change them every two weeks. I usually do two or three weeks. Um, but I've noticed that the more you change, no problem, especially if you do acrylic. A lot of people do acrylic. Girl, you're not supposed to do acrylic on your toes because your toes, they don't come out. You could have your toes done and they will last for a month. And I'm serious. like a month okay but if you do acrylic you're gonna file the nail you're gonna put acrylic on your toes and you're gonna file again and you're gonna mess up the enamel of the nail okay let's say it's the enamel so the nail starts getting bitter brittle, and starts getting soft and it starts breaking and now your nail polish is gonna break now you're gonna put acrylic on your toes because of all that and people maintain that and that will become fungus if you don't take care of it I'm not a specialist, but I know because I've done my research and I I always take a break, mostly one month or two months, depends how I'm feeling. And I do it. And if I need to get them done, I don't even need to go to the salon. I do it myself. I have everything here. I have my gel. I have everything. But I would never 
Never put gel on your toes. Never. And I mean never. Okay? Um, I usually scrub my feet every day. I actually haven't scrubbed my feet for a while. But in the winter, they get really dry. Right now, they're kind of dry because I was walking outside. Like, barefoot. I walked the dog and it was cold. So, they're like, dry. And I'm very, like, cautious about that. But at home, you know, I'm mostly barefoot if it's not that cold or in socks. But I try to be barefoot because, like I said, the nails breathe. So, I actually need to do my toes. So, I think I'm going to do my toes maybe this week on Sunday because that's what the lady opened. We like that. And, but I try not to put a nail polish because I need to get that breathe. Like I said, I wear shoes all the time in my job. So, they don't breathe as much as they used to breathe before when I was home. So, as soon as I get home, I take everything off. Oh, you're welcome. So, you guys have to understand that your nails is like your teeth. You see, if you brush your teeth twice a day, but you're supposed to brush with a soft brush. If you if you brush with a hard brush or medium brush, the enamel is going to go and then you're going to have cavities and then you're going to have to do composite and you have to do all these things, right, that people don't want. But you do it because you think it's not as hard as you brush, it's the way you brush. You don't brush like this, you brush like this and you're gone, okay? The same thing goes in your nails. If you, excuse me, buddy, what are you doing? You want to say hi, come. If you do your nails all the time and you do acrylic, and I know a lot of people do gel and acrylic, which is dumb, okay? Remember, when they take that nail polish out, that nail is going to be yellow as the sun. And it's going to start breaking. And everything is going to chip. So, when I notice when my nails get weak, I, I feel it. So, I just stop doing nail polish. I stop filing. I, no, I just do treatment on my nail. I just put nail polish as for treatment. And I just keep it in it. And that's how it, it stays like natural. And you have to dry your feet, okay? And you have to wash your feet. I've heard people say, somebody told me, do you wash your feet? I'm like, what? I said, yes. I'm like, do you wash your feet? They're like, no, because the soap that I get in my body goes through my toes, so I don't need to wash. I'm like, oh, God. No, you have to wash your feet, okay? Inside out, scrub. I have a loofah, and I'm all in there. I told you guys, I don't have a really scent. I actually sold two socks before, and it's because I had to wear them for, I think it was a month I wore the sock, a month. And I just put it in a Ziploc. And I don't know how it smelled, because I never smelled it, but I don't have a scent. And to tell you the truth, people that has the feet smell, it's their hygiene is no good. Unless you wear a sock like I did, I wear a sock for a month. And I mean a month. I feel so disgusted, but it was like somebody wanted it. Freddy Krueger? Oh my god. That's like old school. I barely watched it. I saw his face, his claws, and I'm like, oh, no, I can't do it. I did watch it, but I watched it like, like this. And to tell you the truth, when I watch a movie like that, I can't sleep for like maybe like three months because I sleep with it and I feel like it's touching me. It's crazy. Um, okay, trick or treating. For me, it's Friday the 13th. I'm going to watch those movies. Um, I have this thing as I don't like candy. You guys see I never eat candy. Never, never. I barely eat chips, but this is like corn natural, so I have it. I don't like chocolate. If it's not dark chocolate, I don't eat it. Sometimes I get something that is not dark chocolate because I'm allergic to dairy. I'm allergic to milk, so I don't usually eat it, but I, I hate candy, okay? I hate it, but I do have gummies. I'm obsessed with this gummies called the Lebanese. 
and they're my obsession. Let me bring it to you guys. It is the best candy, and I mean the best. It is sugar-free, dairy-free, lactose-free. I think, I don't know. Let me show it to you. But I have two big bags. I'm going to show you one. She's in Michael Myers. <laughs> Never watch that one. I always see her body, but I never watch it. I'm gonna show you one. I'm gonna show you one bag. Albanese. Oh, it's not Albanese. Albanese World Best Candy. And let me tell you, the title, it's real. It's a hundred calories. I have two of these bags. This is two point two point twenty-five pounds. Okay? This is a lot okay this and serving size if you eat nine pieces it's a hundred calories a hundred calories hundred and it's what gluten-free fat-free and low sodium this is like the best okay i'm like obsessed with it i haven't opened it because i have not but I have two of these big bags. Oh my god, look at them, they're delicious. And yes, I do count nine. Oh god. Mmm. Oh god. Mm -mm. Oh my god. Mmm. Thanks. Okay, let me tell you a secret. Wait, let me count my candy. Four. What? Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine. Guys, I didn't need 100 calories, but when I have cravings, this is the stuff, okay? The reason I lost so much weight, because I, I eat. Don't, don't get me wrong, I eat a lot. Sometimes I eat more than my husband. But I don't have sugar. It is so good. Okay. One day I was downstairs doing my hair. I was waxing. I think I was waxing my eyebrows or something. Um, oh my god, it's so good. Mm -hmm. And it was my eyebrows because I took my glasses off. And I put my glasses on the toilet. You guys have to try this, okay? And let me know how it tastes like. I finished waxing my eyebrows. Hi, Johnson. I know, I'm sorry. I've been so lost. Horrible, but I'm here trying to cook and eat at the same time. And I sat my ass in the glasses, and they are like, I think they cracked or something. But you see, this one is glassy. And this one is like a white thing. I have to go change them, but I'm so tired. I have to see. How are you? Yes, my feet are very moist. I promise you that. And no, I don't let people touch my feet. Well, it was funny because my husband, he's like, do you even like people touching your feet i said no i don't like that the only one that touches my feet is the lady that does my toes mm, i miss you guys too oh my god i think this is a limited edition because i have not taken this flavors to me sir mm. Guys, tag Albanese. This is my favorite. Give me some of this, Albanese. Hashtag, I love you. Mm. 
It is so good. But I can only have nine. Because they're 100 calories. But I love them. And people say, ew, gluten free, ugh, fat free, low sodium, ew. No. It is the bomb. Mm, the bomb.com. The other socks I'm wearing, I was walking in them too. These were my daughter, but she doesn't want them, so I like, I, I take everything they don't want. I take socks because I would destroy them. I have mostly black socks because they become black. Because I walk outside, I go all the way outside, go to the car. I have pavers, cement, so these are the ones. So I use those and I destroy them. Excuse me, you guys want to see Fuzzy? Look at him. He has his car heart. I have the same jacket. So we go out. I wear my Uggs and the car heart jacket of the handsome boy. I have the same one. He's very, look, it's over there. He's very grouchy sometimes. You guys have a Shih Tzu because this Shih Tzu that I have, he is very grouchy. I don't understand. He's like very like, Ugh. and he's seven. Imagine when he's like 10, he's gonna like bite everybody. Yes, you can't do that. Yeah, guys, you can super chat if you want. Yes. Shut up, Fuzzy. You get me upset too. It's very grouchy because I'm not paying mind to him. So, oh my god, I'm so excited to eat fried fish and you have a yerky I, they're so cute but don't they get grouchy this one is like so grouchy and he's little when he was little he was you cannot like really hug him that much because he's like uh, i'm like shut up i'm telling you i miss you beautiful bear, but oh, thanks. I miss you guys too. I'm telling you, I have. Oh, remember, remember you guys that I, I didn't have a computer, so now I have a computer. And my, my camera's working and everything's working. I love it. Yes, you could super chat. Show your beautiful bear feet, please. I will do it if you guys super chat me. I have a Yerky. Just boom. Thank you for your super chat. I'll show you why I make it. Can't see what you're at. Can't see. <laughs> Did they get big? I don't think so. 
You guys think it got bigger? Let me know if you guys think my feet got bigger. I think it's the angle. Okay, you guys watch me for a long time. What size I am? Love you too, Johnson. What size do you guys think I am? <laughs> what size? Look, look at the size. Let me know. You guys watch me for a long time. You guys are, you've been following me for a very long time. Let me know what size you guys I am. No. <laughs> I'm not. Steven, you should know my size. You've been watching me for a while. It looks big, right? No? Thanks, I miss you guys. No? You guys, I thought you guys were following me for a while. What's going on? You forgot? No? Okay, Steven, seven and a half, eight, depends on what? Depends on what I could, um, depends on what I wear. If I want to be perfect, it will be seven and a half. And if I want it to be a little loose, but like still perfect, eight. I could do eight and seven and a half. I prefer eight most of the time. So the Dr. Martens that I have, they're... I think they're eight. <laughs> <Bunch of gold. laughs> Alex, you're so funny. Yes, I am a seven and a half, eight. I could do, um, yeah, I mostly do eight. I like eight. <sighs> And I haven't done my toes. Imagine if you see they look big right now. And I my nails are short because I cut them. Because usually when I cut my nails, they are um they're gonna be all non-colored, so they're gonna be like naked, bare, so they will grow nice and healthy. So when I get my nail polish back, they're gonna be like, wow. But I do videos of me and my nail polish on my bare feet too, so. Thank you guys for your super chat. Thank you so much. Wow. Don't forget to super chat if you guys want to see my other feet. Thank you. No, six, seven and a half, eight is my size. <laughs> oh. I 
I really don't like anybody touching my feet or anyone unless it's the lady that does my teeth, my my feet. I will ask next time. Thanks. Thank you, Tinsley. Thank you for your super chat. Uh, my husband does, but I don't like anyone touching my feet. I'm not like, like, uh, touch my feet, touch my feet. No, just eight, William, just eight. But he does touch my feet. But it's not like like I want to be, you know, my feet to be touched. Yeah, it's weird that you guys are asking me because I said, um, I said it, he said it to me. It's like, do you even like people touching your feet? I was like, no, I don't like that. <sighs> so no, babe. I don't like that. Listen, my husband loves me all me. No, seven and a half, eight. If it's a pointy shoe, I'll do eight. And thank you so much. Oh, it was really wild that I spilled my camera fell. <laughs> Wait, let me fix it. <sighs> you see, this is, this happens because I don't bring my tripod. If I bring my tripod, this wouldn't happen. I promise. Okay, if I move the... What? No. Why would they do that? Why would they? Steven, that's not nice. That is not nice. Thank you, Tinsley. You guys are so nice. You guys love your placa. I know, but if you say it to your head and think about it, it doesn't make sense, right, Stephen?
Okay guys, I'm gonna let you guys go. I will see you guys in my next video. I have to go and cook. I'm so happy to see you guys. I'm so happy you guys are here. Thank you guys for your super chat. Remember, comment, like, and share. Don't forget to subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. Share with everybody you know your friends. Remember to add me to Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, Snapchat. So many, I'm telling you. Instagram. You guys know what to do. Bye. I love you. I'm going to go do my toes. Bye. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you guys do the fried fish with the cucumber salad. Bye. So let me know if you guys do the fried fish with the cucumber salad. Enjoy, enjoy you guys Halloween. Make sure you guys are safe. I will post a video this week. And guys, hashtag Albanese so they could give your, you know, Placa Squat some good stuff. So I love you guys so much. Bye. Thank you, Placa Squat.